Yo, what's up, guys? It's Wow Shiny IC here, bringing you another episode into the Magic Mode show. I do believe now there is only one more episode after this, so it's going to be the grand finale next week. But in our first game, just before that, we have got Walls. And uh, we went up against Walls thinking it could be an easy game, just to the fact, well, it was a must win game anyway, in general. But uh, it was going to be an easy game, hopefully. But in the 8th minute, we make a bit of a kerfuffle with a uh, clearance. And uh, they do get shot away. But luckily, Miller actually pulls it back out the bag. And does end up saving it for us. Um, heard on the ball now to Moore. Moore starting again. And Moore does get the shot away. And quite got a lot of confidence in Moore, especially after that first game. Uh, but obviously, he is still a youth player. So it's kind of like he won't get as many goals as I would like. But uh, he had another shot away there, but Maynard on the ball, lovely through ball by Hood, and look at this, outstrengths the defender, slots it home. It was so close, at first I was like, oh great, uh, it wasn't enough power on the ball, but Nicky Maynard showed some courage, got in front of the ball, and we do end up going 1-0 just before half time. Here we have free kick, 51 for 51st minute, and he does hit the wall, but win now, doesn't want to let it go out, crosses it in to Clark and I really liked that goal and I thought wow that was actually awesome just the way that Wynn charged it down kept it in because at first I was thinking should I get for a corner I thought bugger it get it in cross it in and the two defenders linking up there as well uh, getting us another goal and cruising towards the first place position hopefully uh, 71st minute now we do have Heard lovely pass in play we back the bender bender back forward and look at this I'm just trying to control the game more more very close, just to the outside of the post. Not bad for his uh, right foot, seeming he is left footed. And we do end up winning that game. And little collateral damage at the end. And we do end up winning that game 2 0. And not a bad result for us. And we do go into the next game with our second leg. And you see, we are very close at the top now. It's just it's ridiculous on how close it is. But we do go in to our second leg against SL Benfica. And uh, King at the make a return during this game uh, because a lot of strikers, uh, well, in the previous game actually, uh, came on just due to the fact that everyone's tired and it's really annoying at the moment. So, uh, win at the place CDM, unfortunately, due to McEachern being injured and also Bender being tired. So, win was playing the CDM role. Uh, we do have Nicky Maynard on the ball now at front with CC. Maynard cuts back inside, looks at the shot, gets a shot away, but. Gets apparently lucky enough because he got pushed off the ball. And without a doubt, that's a main thing in here. And we got Nicky Maynard slots it on top left-hand corner. And what a goal. Secures the first goal for us. And we do go 2-0 up on aggregate and also 1-0 up on um, today's game. But they do they kept pushing us as well, guys. It wasn't exactly like we were... like Oh, look at this little run by Pappas. Oh, my God. it was It just needed a finish. Taps around the defender, does really well. But we do have uh, Ben Fick on the ball now, lovely pass in play, gets a shot away, lovely save from Millerlove once again. They kept attacking us, and I knew for a fact if I conceded it wasn't too bad, but to Millerlove again, one on one, picking it out the bound, what a save. Um, yeah, I didn't know that if we drew one on, it was all good, but it was the fact if I drew one, one well, if they scored, would have been like they got more momentum than us and they would have ended up scoring maybe another goal. But we do end up winning that game 1 0, 2 0 on aggregate, and we do proceed to the Euro League final. Uh, without that, that's an achievement just due to the fact that in the previous uh, season we didn't get past the group stages. So improvements were made and improvements have succeeded. Newcastle in our next game, Denver CC up front with uh, Brian. And you see now Nicky may, uh, Nicky may not even, Solizano and King up front. So the, the strikers keep changing constantly and constantly. Bannum's back and also a lot of the other original players are back as well. But uh, Newcastle started off well. They just missed an absolute sit out. Oh, that was ridiculously close. Uh, Cissé was a pain to play against. King on the ball now over the top to Solizano. Solizano cuts inside. Lots of the shot, gets the shot away and it's just over the bar and just a little, just a little tad out for us. And uh, we do end up keep pushing forward again and again. So we were really pretty good against Newcastle. I was fairly surprised. And like this, uh, Solzano keeping the ball, slide tackling, gives it the King. And he does end up scoring for us, lucky enough, King. And without a doubt, he's an awesome player, guys. I'm surprised how he's still only 69 rated. He's been getting goals for me. He's been pushing forward for me. He's just... He, he's been an overall great player since January. And I didn't expect him to slot into the side very easily. 
but he has and King is like from January brilliant player and so is Anale hitting the bar just for half time and at half time we go in at 1-0 um, so it's not bad now we are controlling the game it's kind of disappointing that we are only going at like 1-0 at the moment because especially with the goal difference it looks like a goal difference will be a factor within the, who will take the Premier League title after a while just due to the fact that um, I, think, I believe Chelsea are level with us on goal difference and also uh, Man United are actually got less than us. But Newcastle will go through now. And it does look like we do give away a penalty. Really disappointing. It's like wow that's a harsh penalty to give away if I'm totally honest with him. But they step up for it. But I trust my man Milev and he does end up saving it. And what a save that was. He kept charging up right. The way he charged up then I didn't even press Y. He just kept running and running after him constantly. Like it was ridiculous. But we do end up winning that game 1-0. It was only 1-0 victory, but it was a, still a victory. Another three points. And we do, ladies and gentlemen, leapfrog over Manchester United. Three points behind Chelsea. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.